Understanding Live On in Infamy, A Deep Dive into Language. Hello everyone, welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're going to explore a fascinating phrase, live on in infamy. This expression is not just a collection of words, but a gateway to understanding culture, history, and the power of language. Let's dive in and unravel its meaning together. First, let's break down the phrase, live on in infamy. The word, live on, suggests continuing to exist or be remembered. Infamy, on the other hand, is a noun meaning fame or recognition for something negative or bad. Together, the phrase implies that someone or something continues to be remembered for a notorious or shameful act. Understanding the historical context of a phrase can enrich its meaning. The phrase, live on in infamy, is often associated with President Franklin D. Roosevelt's speech following the attack on Pearl Harbor in 1941. He famously stated that the date would live in infamy, marking it as a notorious moment in history. This usage emphasizes that the phrase often refers to a significant event with negative connotations. In modern times, the phrase is used more broadly. It can refer to any event, person, or action that is remembered negatively. For example, a scandalous political decision might be said to live on in infamy. It's a way of saying that the negative impact or reputation of something will continue to be remembered. It's important to understand the nuances of this phrase. Live on in infamy is not just about being famous for something bad, it's about an enduring legacy of notoriety. Also, it's often used in a somewhat formal or dramatic context. Using it in everyday conversation about minor misdeeds might sound overly dramatic. I hope this exploration of live on in infamy has been enlightening. Phrases like this are not just words strung together. They carry history, emotion, and cultural significance. Remember, language is a living, evolving entity, and understanding its nuances can enrich your communication skills. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.